Hey guys, so today's video I'm going to show you how I got this red ombre look using crochet hair. So we're going to start off by showing you my braid pattern as well as the hair I'm going to be using in this tutorial. I'm using a total of four packs. I have two packs of the red ombre hair and I also have two packs of the black hair which is in color 1B. You are going to need a crochet hook and I'm going to show you how I braided my hair. I started by having the braids go straight back and they are connected. So basically I would braid the next corn roll and just take that piece of hair and connect it to the corn roll next to it. Also I braided the back in a right to left motion and I'm going to take that excess hair and I'm going to just crochet that in between the braid so that nothing is showing and everything is laying flat. So you can braid your hair going straight back but this is my braid pattern since I have it in a protective style and this is very easy for me and I like the way the hair lays. So this is the bundle of hair. You're going to get about six to eight pieces per bundle but as you can see the hair is very thick so you don't want to put too much in the back because it can get really big really fast. So I'm just going to apply the hair using the traditional latch hook method. Pull the hair through the latch hook make a small hole and then you're going to pull the excess hair through that hole and then when you pull on the end of the hair it's going to tighten up your knot which you made in that little loop and you're going to continue to do this process throughout the entire head. So you're, again you're going to take your latch hook needle, you're going to pull it through the corn roll and you're going to attach your hair inside of the small loop that's on your latch hook. You're going to create a small space and that is where you're going to loop your hair through and this is how you're going to secure your hair to your braid. So you're going to continue this process and you're going to use a total of one full pack which is two bundles. This is my second bundle here. You're going to apply that to the back of your head and then you're going to move on to pack number two. So I'm going to take the second pack of black hair and I'm going to fill in this portion here just on the sides. The easiest way for me to do this was again to separate the hair. It's already separate in the pack so I would just add one pack to one side and I would add the extra pack on the other. So both sides of my hair equals one pack. So now we have a total of two packs of hair in and we're going to start to add our red hair. We're going to do this the same way we did the back. Create the loop, pull the hair through and pull on the hair not too tight but you're just going to secure your loop. But I do want to share with you how I got the ombre look. Now I knew that I was going to be cutting the hair to give it some shape so what I decided to do was install the hair but not even. Typically I would just fold it over making sure that the ends were the same length but I decided not to do that. I made sure that one length was longer and one length was shorter than the other. That way if I decided to cut it it would give me more of a highlighted look as you can see you see some red is higher up than at the bottom so when I cut it I basically wouldn't cut all of the red ombre off. So I'm going into the last pack which is my fourth pack. I'm going to continue to install it and I'm going to show you what the finished product looks like. So this is what the finished product looks like. This is before I did any cutting. If you want your hair to be a little bit longer, you could stop right here, add a little bit of shine spray or hair oil, and this can be your completed look. But I did want to make it a little bit shorter in the back. So I decided to cut off some of the black that was at the bottom. So I didn't want to have too much hair on the bottom. So what I decided to do was kind of give it a nice bob cut in the back without touching any of the red ombre in the front. So ladies, that is it for this hair tutorial. Very simple, very easy, and very fast. This entire look only took me 30 minutes start to finish. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next hair tutorial.